Kieran, obviously not the result that anybody wanted tonight. How do you reflect on, on the performance? Um, no, nah, it's a tough one to take, to be honest. I thought we were the team in control, had the possession, had a few chances, probably like to create more, uh, more clear-cut chances. Um, but it's, it's disappointing. Um, you can tell by the, the crowd reaction, they're disappointed in us as well. So um, now we go away with our clubs and get ready for the summer and just um, come back with energy and enthusiasm because we've got an exciting summer ahead. The manager has always said that it's really important not to get too high when the results go your way. Is it a case of not getting too low when the, when things aren't going so well? I think we need, to, we need to remember how far we've came as well in the last few years and what we've got ahead of us. So there's no point of getting too low and no point of beating ourselves up. I mean, no, we can do better. We know we have to be better going into the summer. Um, but better happening now than in the summer. So it's two games that we can learn from and take experience from going into these um, summer games. And personally for you, you got minutes across across both games in this camp. How much have you, you taken from the last 10 days? I love it here. Um, I'm so, so happy when I'm back in Scotland with the boys. Um, I love the manager, I love the players, I love the coaching staff. It's a, a great environment to be in. Um, and you just look forward to it. You count down the days till you go. Um, it's an amazing team and as I said it's been a disappointing week but we'll, we'll learn from it for sure um, and we'll come back ready to go in the summer. And just finally you've mentioned it already, it is, it's a big summer ahead, how important is it to, to stay positive and not lose sight of the objective? A hundred percent, these games we'll analyse them and we can quickly forget about them, um, learn from them and just move on from them because as I said we've got two more uh, friendlies in the summer before um, the Euros so there's a lot to look forward to and I think we need to be positive.